Hello everybody, this is Johnny21 and welcome back to another Minecraft Noteblock tutorial video. Today we're going to be making Crab Brave and just let's take a little listen. For this tutorial you're going to need 20 note blocks and 20 repeaters as well as 20 of whatever block you're going to place under the note blocks to get a specific sound. I've chosen dirt to get the piano sound but you could choose whatever you want and you're also going to need a little bit of redstone dust if you want to have it loop. So let's get to the tutorial. To start you're going to want to place down a note block on 8 clicks. Next a repeater on 2 ticks followed by a note block on 16 clicks. Next, a repeater on 2 ticks, followed by a note block on 13 clicks. Next, a repeater on 2 ticks, followed by a note block on 13 clicks. Then a repeater on 1 tick, followed by a note block on 8 clicks. Next, a repeater on 2 ticks, followed by a note block again on 8 clicks. Then a repeater on 1 tick, followed by a note block on 15 clicks. Then a repeater on 2 ticks, followed by a note block on 11 clicks. Next, a repeater on 2 ticks, followed by a note block on 11 clicks. Next, a repeater on 1 tick, followed by a note block on 8 clicks. Next, a repeater on 2 ticks, followed by a note block on 8 clicks. Then a repeater on 1 tick, followed by a note block on 15 clicks. Next a repeater on 2 ticks, followed by a note block on 11 clicks. Then a repeater on 2 ticks, followed by a, another note block on 11 clicks. Next, a repeater on one tick, followed by a note block on six clicks. Then a repeater on two ticks, followed by another note block on six clicks. Next, a repeater on two ticks, followed by a note block on ten clicks. Then a repeater on two ticks, followed by another note block on ten clicks. Next, a repeater on 1 tick, followed by a note block on 11 clicks. Then a repeater on 1 tick, followed by a note block on 10 clicks. Now, if you want to link this together and make it loop, then you can just put a repeater on one tick in between here. You don't actually need the redstone dust, like I said earlier, because you can just do it like this. And then you're just going to want a way of powering it. I like to use pressure plates and it should sound like this. Thanks for watching. If you found this useful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you want to learn how to make even more note block songs. I'm approaching a thousand subscribers, so if you could help me out in getting there, it's going to hopefully happen really soon. I hope sometime this week. And yeah, thanks to everyone who's subscribed to me so far. And as always, this has been Jono21, and I shall see you later.